This is Factory Fridays from Boats.com, the show where we visit builders across America to get a first-hand look at their boat building techniques, materials, and stories. Hi, I'm Marilyn with Boats.com, checking in today from Sea Hunter Boats, one of the fastest growing center console fishing boat companies in Florida. This company has grown exponentially over the years from a three to four million dollar company to 50 million dollars. And they're about to expand not just their facility, but their production doubling in size here that also includes their own service marina at the entrance to the Florida Keys. So we're gonna go inside to see how it's done. Let's take a walk. At Sea Hunter, it all starts here in design and engineering. Everything is done in house from the 3D CAD system that Alan Martinez has worked on with the owner, Ralph Montavo, to create all of their designs, which started with an 18 foot flats boat and grew into a 31 foot, then continued to grow into bigger V bottoms and then cats. So the company has been riding the trends in the fishing and family boating industry as the company has grown from 2004 to its current state. And as the company expands, so are its offerings. And we're gonna see that out on the floor, which include a five axis CNC cutting machine and all of the both traditional and new technology methods in boat building. Let's go see what's happening out on the factory floor. Overbuilt is how Sea Hunter likes to describe its construction. They use copious amounts of Kevlar for strength, oversized stringers, and even their transom itself is built very thick in composites, so the boat is extremely strong and safe. They've even recounted examples to us about how a boat can be in a serious accident and still be able to be rebuilt and reconstructed because of its original strength. So Sea Hunter pays a lot of attention to the integrity of each boat. In addition to the main floor of the factory, Sea Hunter also has a separate department here for lamination of smaller parts. They use the fiberglass and a lot of carbon fiber, especially in their hatches, because that makes them strong but very light. A nice advantage when you have a number of hatches and fish boxes in every center console. So let's see what's going on in the rest of the factory. Here in assembly, we've got at least 15 boats under all different stages of construction. From finishing, there's electrical in-house upholstery, and right here we've even got a deck about to be melded with its hull. So as you can see, it's pretty tight in here right now, and this is gonna be over doubled in the next year or so. You can see here some of the innovative aspects of the Sea Hunter catamaran bottom. They traditionally built a non-step V bottom, but when they shifted to the cat construction, they added steps, which created a whole new design that they created to make this a very seaworthy boat. So after all the boats are finished inside, they come out here for quality control and final inspection. And behind me here, you'll see the new 38 cat, which is the newest in the line, in addition to the 41 and 46 cat that have just been released. So thanks for joining us here at Boats.com for Factory Fridays. See you again soon. This is Factory Fridays from Boats.com. Follow Boats.com on YouTube and Instagram to stay tuned for the next episode. Visit Boats.com for more videos and boat-related content. Boats.com. Everything Boats.